What's up everybody, it's Chris Mecca here. Uh, I'm gonna show you how to do a little automation trick where you can uh, pretty much go through your whole beat out. Some people would ca call it the, the Mike Will effect or whatever. It's just pretty much it's pretty much just an EQ filter. But I'm gonna show you how to do it. This is what it is, if you don't know. Something like this. <laughs> And that was just the bullshit example of one, but I'm pretty sure you understand what I'm talking about. But what we're going to do here is I'm going to delete this. Uh, I'm to delete it out of here first. Alright, first off, we're going to have to get the parametric EQ2 out. Or, you can do this with anything really, but what we're going to do here is, there's an option here where it's last tweet. Create automation to now what we're going to do is, you have to click here, and create that. So when, you know, it's going, it will do that. Like however you want to fucking have fun with this. But as you can see, as it's going it's a really simple thing to do and you can do this with any like thing like you can load up any type of Next is anything. The last thing you clicked, you can go to tools, the last tweak, and you can automate that knob. It's a little cool automation trick, and you can do it for your EQ and have that make that cool effect. But uh, thanks guys. Uh, hope you all enjoyed this and helped you all out. I'm out.